As the organizer of this protest, what are your comments about the recent events with the Freddie Gray incident? Uh, well, I think it's, uh, you know, it's an outrage what happened to Freddie Gray, and I think that's where we need to start uh, the whole conversation. Um, people want to talk about lawlessness and violence, but the lawlessness and violence started with the government, with uh, the representatives of the government, the police officers who severed the spine of Freddie Gray. And uh, by not uh, acting swiftly to indict these officers, um, we're creating a situation where uh, people are feeling unheard and their rights being trampled upon. And it's just a reflection of, uh, you know, many more incidents in Baltimore that have caused this uh, outrage. So what are you all trying to accomplish by this protest tonight? Well, the protest tonight is just to show that uh, not everybody in America, you know, goes along with the narrative that's being run in the mass media, that it's a bunch of thugs and criminals uh, running the streets. Um, we want to show solidarity with the people of Baltimore, the protesters, and um, with the family of Freddie Gray. What is the turnout expectation for tonight? Um, it's difficult to say, but we do think there'll be over a thousand people, maybe uh, quite more than that. Um, but uh, it, we put out the call just in a day or two. Uh, you know, we've gotten over a couple thousand uh, RSVPs on Facebook as an indication of the, the interest out there. So we've heard that um, the protest tonight is supposed to be peaceful and nonviolent, but how can we guarantee that that will happen? Obviously, the one in Baltimore has not been that way. Well, I mean, from the from our the standpoint of, as organizers, we definitely are calling for a peaceful protest. We're not trying to uh, encourage any violence. We're not going to be encouraging uh, really any disruption. We just want to. We want to air our concerns, we want to gather up uh, forces in a public display of solidarity and protest in opposition to, uh, you know, the, the state of things in the country right now. So um, as far as guarantee, I mean, I can't guarantee anything, but we'll do whatever we can to, to, to maintain a peaceful protest and definitely encourage that, you know, from the, from the podium. So. Do you personally think it will be peaceful tonight? I do think so. I, I don't think uh, uh, we have any reason to believe it won't be. Um, we just had a march in Roxbury last uh, Saturday, the 18th, and uh, that was very peaceful. You know, there was no confrontations with the police and uh, no arrests, and uh, we hope for the same thing tonight. Great. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you.